One of the best component upgrades you can perform on your gaming PC is to replace the graphics card with a faster model. Being a PC gamer for well over 10 years now, I've upgraded my graphics card nearly twice as regularly as my processor and RAM. This is because many new video games, particularly AAA titles, are continually attempting to push the boundary on graphical fidelity. One important thing to note when upgrading your graphics card is whether your existing power supply will support it, so make sure to check the power requirements for the card before you buy it. Hey guys, it's Fraser from Manwave, and today we're going to show you how to swap from an old graphics card to a new one. I have an RTX 2080 Super from Galax here, and it's going to be replacing the lower end RTX 2060 currently inside this computer. This card says that it requires 650 watts, one 6 pin, and one 8 pin PCIe power connection, which I've checked against the power supply inside this computer and can confirm that it meets those requirements, is a known brand, and is gold rated, so I'm happy to use it. Try to avoid placing your PC on a carpet as any static buildup could discharge and destroy components inside the computer. If you want to be extra careful, you can use an anti-static wrist strap. I've used one a few times before, but from building hundreds of PCs, I've never actually had a static discharge occur. You can also touch the case or the side of the power supply unit at regular intervals to ensure that you are fully discharged. Otherwise, all you will need is a standard Phillips screwdriver to complete this upgrade. First thing to do is ensure that the PC is unplugged and then remove the two side panels to get access to the components and cables inside. With the side panels off, you can unplug any PCI Express power cables from the GPU if any were actually connected. Now, depending on whether your graphics card is a single, dual, or triple slot, there will be between one to three screws on the I.O. slots to remove. Once it's unscrewed, your old GPU is pretty much ready to remove, except on most motherboards, it will be locked into place by the PCIe lane. Usually, this little tab pushes backwards or down to unlock the graphics card. Now you can remove the old graphics card and lay it to the side. Essentially, installing the new GPU is just the reverse of this. Unbox the new graphics card and place it on the included anti-static bag. When you are ready to install it, pick it up and align it with the PCI Express lane and gently slot it into place. It should go in without forcing it and it should give an audible click when the PCI Express lane locks it in. Then, just take your Phillips and fasten all the screws on the I.O. plate at the back of the PC case. With the graphics card securely in place, plug in the PCI power cable or cables to finish the upgrade. Now that the graphics card is installed, plug in your PC and boot into Windows, then navigate to either NVIDIA or AMD's website, depending on the graphics card that you bought. Here you'll get the latest drivers by picking your graphics card from the drop down boxes and then selecting download. When it's downloaded, simply run the executable to install the drivers. And there we have it. That's how easy it is to upgrade the graphics card and take advantage of better performance in more graphically demanding titles. Thanks for watching the video, we hope it was helpful and that we didn't miss anything out. If you have any other questions, please feel free to comment below. And as always, I'll see you guys again in the next video.